the Diamond Play Button. This is one of the most prestigious YouTube rewards ever, and the chances of you ever actually getting to own one is very low. Unless if you're jack sucks at life or lucky enough to actually hit 10 million subscribers one day. My point is this YouTube play button is very rare and expensive. And what if I told you that Linus Tech Tips basically destroyed his to turn it into a computer. By the time Linus Tech Tips was done with his play button, it was basically just a hollow shell, and that's what we're gonna be talking about today, how he turned a full diamond play button into a computer. And um, did I mention it is RGB? I kinda love RGB, so uh, that's pretty cool. <laughs> Linus Tech Tips hit 10 million subscribers a while ago. He's over 13 million subscribers right now, and um, yes, he was a little late to showing this off. But there's a very good reason for that, and that is because he was doing one of his most ambitious projects yet for his channel. And that is turning a tiny little play button into a computer. Usually a computer is about this size, but somehow he got that to fit inside of a trophy basically. I would say that you could probably fit six YouTube play buttons inside of a standard size PC, but somehow he was able to get one PC to fit in one tiny play button. I can't stress that enough, like how in the world is that even possible? And of course Linus was able to figure something out. He and his team were able to find one of the tiniest motherboards ever to fit inside of this. Now I'm not going to get into all the technical details because most of you guys aren't subscribed here for tech content, but um, I'm going to keep it simple, don't worry. So this all started when he received the play button. Apparently this is something he's been wanting to do before he ever even had 10 million subscribers. Basically he started by having his team create a 3D model of exactly what they wanted to turn the play button into. The play button is solid aluminum with some chrome and some weird stuff on the outside, but it's mostly aluminum. After they made a perfect 3D model with a 3D printer, they took that to a company that could actually dremel out the inside and make it exactly how they want it. They found a really awesome company to do this and they made it look immaculate. So that's how they turned the play button into a little shell that they could put the computer inside of. But it wouldn't be complete if they didn't have that RGB. So of course they found some RGB to put behind the play button. This made this play button look beautiful and all they had to do was put it together and then find a back plate because they got rid of the entire backside. Of course they added a little diamond cutout on the back to add some airflow and it kind of matches the theme. And at this point he basically had a full PC. But I know what you're thinking, could it game? And to answer your question, not really, he would have to bring an external GPU because graphics cards just so happen to take up a very large amount of your system, so he's gonna have to do an external one if he ever wanted to actually game with a diamond play button. Now that is definitely a sentence I would have never guessed I would say. It's not every day that someone's able to fit an entire computer inside of their trophy, and of course no one would do it better than Linus Tech Tips. Obviously if you guys want more information, check Linus's channel out, I'll have a link to the description down below because the the video is awesome. I think it is very fitting that Linus as a tech channel did this and was the first one to do this. So anyways, that is my video on one of the coolest play buttons ever here on YouTube. I hope you guys enjoyed and like always make sure you smash that like button and subscribe for more content. Have a good one gamers.